Welcome everyone to the video. We are loading up the free to play and we are going to go over what we're going with. Um, first of all, major shout out to the Game of Thrones Legends server. Um, you could go into my Discord and get the link to their Discord. They have a very helpful group uh, if you're looking for an alliance. Uh, lots of general chat. Uh, make sure to check it out. It is in the link in the description. So anyway, on the on the free to play account, this is my raid team. I am going with the free synergy synergy, the free city synergy, not free synergy synergy, free city synergy for the bonus stamina. I have Daenerys and Ned in there because the rest of my free cities are pretty weak. One star Daenerys, two star Dothraki Blood Rider. Uh, I do need to wait for the summons to come. It's not coming this month. So that is that. Um, they're doing well for me in events. Uh, if we go to my summons tokens, uh, you'll see I have 44 greens, 14 of the dragons. Uh, 13 of the reds, 7 of the purples, and 5 of the bastard tokens. Um, again, make sure to wait because in the new update, they will be allowing you to get a guaranteed legendary shards for every 10 times pull. It is not updated yet for everyone. It is only on select people. I have also found out that they will be having, you can watch ads for energy once a day and you can watch ads for the summon tokens the red summon tokens once a day in addition to the free one so it's a good way for the game to get revenue from the free to play players as well as do their thing now let's look at roster and what I plan on doing with the free to play account so Obviously, my strongest character is Khal Drago, and we're going to keep him running and going. Zaro is very efficient for sustain. He's helping me get through the campaign. If I go to the campaign, um, I just finished chapter 11, so I'm up to chapter 12 in Treacherous. And then for hard, I'm up to chapter 18. I plan on getting these done. It's important to do the campaign on free to play uh, because you get the good resources from it. Uh, every five chapters gives you a lot of resources. This is a little bit, but every five chapters gives you a lot of resources. So you definitely want to work on that. I kind of hit a wall right now, so I'm waiting. I'm using the free cities to do easy and hard in the events. That's gaining me the most. I also have a good amount of gold dragons. I have 3.4k gold dragons. So I plan on using those for pulls too. And as you can see, my Sam is one star. He's close to two star, 10 shards away. We're definitely gonna be working on Sam uh, because Sam is going to help out in the events. Um, Baelish, I'm not sure. On the main account, I love my shield team. But this requires so many resources, I'm not sure it's the way to go. I'm not sure it's the way to go. I have my Caitlyn. I don't know what I was thinking. I guess I wanted to build an ice team, but I don't think it's the way to go. I don't think it's the way to go for my account. I just unlocked Rhaenyra, one star. That was a good addition. 1-1 one, one is getting stronger. I got my Alistair for the cheese, for easy. Um, so I'm not going to level him up. I'm not going to touch him. Um, could do a shield team in the future. That'd be nice. My Godswood Defender is two star. Would be nice to get him to four star for the Bastards event. Um, let's see. What else? What else? Um, I think what I'm going to do is I have some guys that are almost unlocked. Um, but what I want to do is... I want to focus my green summons on Tyrion. I feel like if I can get my green summons on Tyrion and get him to two star, which is 35 shards, 
might be tough to get, but maybe with this new system in play, Tyrion is coming to the summons. Um, I should be able to do pretty well with the free synergy, free city synergy for the stamina boost and to keep passing it along. I just have to keep Tyrion alive. So Zaro might be doing heavy work with the shields, might use Sam with him as well for even more shield. And yeah, I think I'm going to go with Tyrion. I think I'm going to go all in on Tyrion. I think if I could get Treacherous and potentially Kingslayer done, it will do wonders for this account. And yeah, you just got to have a focus. I mean, I want to do free synergies, free cities more, but I think I hit a wall. And I don't think an extra star on Daenerys is going to do much. The Long Braid has a lot of shards left to go. So I might not even get the third star. And that's not going to help me with Kingslayer. The only thing that's going to help me with Kingslayer is Tyrion. Tyrion is going to be the only thing in a free-to-play account that is going to propel you to get more chapters done in the campaign. So that's more resources. So it's a really good return on investment. Tyrion's coming out this month. So I plan on going hard on Tyrion and hopefully get some good shards for him. So that is my plan for the account in raids i am currently in silver one i might get promoted to gold three which would give me more drago shards and i'll start earning splendid summon tokens but right now i kind of hit a wall and i have to wait for Tyrion to come out if you are free to play i highly recommend going after Tyrion. save your green summon tokens i know they're not easy to get but with the new system, with the 10 times pull, when it, when it gets released, it is not released now. So do not pull now. Hoard your tokens. But when it gets released, it's going to be a great step for the game. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Comment below and let me know how you are doing in your free-to-play progress. And I will talk to you next time.